Hello, mga kananay. It's me again, Nanay Jane. And as promised, um, I'm gonna tell you how to handle or maybe how to move on from your low ratings. So, I was really planning to have this vlog, but it was just very unexpected that um, I'm doing this and I'm sharing or I'll be sharing this based on my experience because if uh, let me just share just today I received a three star rating and I was so surprised it was actually um, a class last night it's 11 uh, 11 to 11 30 p.m and I wasn't able to check the um, rating in the lesson review so I didn't know that my student um, wasn't giving me a rating yet but then uh, this morning um, upon checking my account so my rating was still five so I was so happy that I think everything went well with my previous lessons or my previous classes and then this afternoon I was actually ready to conduct my first book class but i was so surprised that my rating my monthly rating from five became 4.83 so i checked um the lesson review right away the evaluation by textbook then i manually changed the date to may 3 uh, 2020 sunday and tada i found the three or i saw the three number three for my daily news and that was last night so i was really really disappointed and i was actually distracted but yeah i still tried my best to conduct my book class um even after uh <laughs> learning that yeah i actually received a three-star rating um why am i so affected uh maybe it's because uh i did my best but i guess my best wasn't good enough so yeah <laughs> it's like when uh, upon seeing the uh that figure it's like a song goes at the back of my mind and where did I tell me? Where did I go wrong? And then, yeah. So, uh, I was so really disappointed. But then, um, yeah, I have to, uh, I have to move on. Okay. So, yeah. So, what will you do um, if you received a low star rating? Um, these are based on what I did the whole day because it was, yeah, it happened all of a sudden and, um, I decided to have this vlog so that the, you know, the feeling is still fresh and yeah, so what are we going to do if we receive this three stars, two stars or one star? Um, first, uh, I think you need to have a self-reflection. Um, think of the possible reasons why the student gave you a low star rating or such rating. Um, was it because of the internet connection? Um, maybe because of the audio that didn't work? Or perhaps your speaking speed, maybe you were too fast or maybe you were too slow or uh, maybe you were not uh, able to answer the students questions or maybe you were not able to teach the lesson material smoothly because it was your first time to handle such material or just maybe because the student has a higher expectation and you were not able to meet that expectation so um, maybe the student wasn't satisfied with your class although you gave your best and that's what happened to me i guess because as for me when i look back um on our class uh, i am sure that i gave and i did my 100 percent best like i always do with uh, my every class and um, it was actually daily news so i was used at teaching that material and we had a very smooth class um 
she was smiling, we were laughing, but um, however, on the part wherein um, we needed to listen to the audio of the whole um, news article, um, she said that she couldn't hear me. So she suddenly reconnected um, the call and when she came back, she said, oh, I'm sorry. Um, sorry, that was her voice um, because she has the sweetest voice I have ever heard. And I complimented her. I even put that in the message part and in the in the message um, or in the feedback that I sent to her. And yeah, so she was, she said, uh, I'm sorry, I, I... I couldn't hear the audio. So that's what she said at first. And then when she reconnected, she said, I'm sorry, but I could hear the audio. So I was like, oh, okay, it's all right. And then, yeah, so the class went on. And then during the um, the part wherein she needed to read the whole article, because that's really part of the lesson, um, when she was about to finish the whole article, she said, this is quite long. But then I, we both laughed. So, and I assured her, oh, you're almost done. Okay, so yeah, I thought it was okay. And then um, on that part wherein she needed to answer um, the question based on the given situations, she actually had a hard time. And I guided her. Um, I gave my best to reassure her that it's all right. You are learning. Um I am here to help you, blah, blah, blah. And then um, we, it's just that we were not able to finish the remaining two questions um, in the lesson because um, she's actually slow at speaking and, 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 and reading. And yeah, so we said goodbye 10 seconds before our class ended. And um, her voice was so sweet when she said, Thank you so much. See you again. But yeah, um, that was, uh, so uh, I thought that the class was right, was okay. And um, that's why I was so surprised uh, seeing that ra that kind of rating because I don't think I deserve that. You know, if it's, it, if it was free talking, I will gladly accept that three stars because um, I am really not good at um, holding a conversation. Uh, free talking is really my, my weakness. So I will really accept if I will receive even two or one stars. But daily news and with that kind of um, class that we had, yeah, I really didn't have an idea that she's going to give me a three-star rating. But, um, yeah, I need to accept the the thought that maybe she wasn't just satisfied with how our class went well. Think about it. So, I am sure that um, this happened to you as well. And you have the same sentiment. But after self-reflecting, and if we found out that we, we really made a mistake somehow during the lesson. Um, we need to accept it and take it or use it as an opportunity to be better and to improve. And yeah, to have uh, a better class next time. But if you think that you didn't do anything wrong uh, and that you are sure that um, the class really went on very, very smoothly, then you just need to accept the fact that low ratings or having low ratings is really inevitable with this kind of job. And we must face the truth that this job is really performance-based and that no matter how hard we try, we really cannot please everybody. So, you know, the song goes, even the best fall down sometimes. And after self-reflecting, then go ahead and work again. You know, that's the only way to save your low rating, to conduct more classes, because that's what happened to me just today. Um, so like what I shared in my previous vlog, I am not actually conducting sudden lessons anymore because um, I want to 
I want to save my rank. And it's actually the third day of the month or the cutoff, but I was able to achieve um, the requirements for the next rank in terms of bookings. But I need to save myself from receiving one or two stars so that I can also save my ranking. Uh, yeah, and we all know that um, we are more prone to receive one or two stars from sudden lessons so yeah i'm saving myself but um thankfully um book classes came just when i needed them most because um after conducting this book lessons for today from 4.83 uh, in my monthly ratings uh, it's now 4.92 and from 4.33 in my weekly ratings, it's now 4.75. So at least I am relieved that somehow it uh, was able to increase. And um, even more grateful that in my profile, it's still 4.98. So it's not that bad. But um, yeah. Uh, seeing that three stars in my profile is still a heartache for me but so I need to move on and be wiser that is why after receiving three stars from that student um, which I really feel is uh, unreasonable and yeah I don't deserve that I realized that I should not trust my students maybe ex except for our regular students but yeah especially for those beginners and for first timers because actually that student who gave me a low star rating she's a first timer here at native camp because in her history he didn't she didn't have a history of her past lessons so yeah i thought i thought she's a, a new student and I was her very first teacher and she gave me three stars. Those smiles, those um, thank yous and sorries during the class, they can be deceiving. And that um, you think the class went well, but after or when the class has ended, ta-da, three stars, two stars, one star. And the teacher is left defenseless. But I think we also can at least try to dispute um, such rating. And we can only do that if we have a proof. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to record our class with this student who gave me three stars. Um, yeah, I, I, I actually used to record my classes using OCAM. Um, if I think or I feel that I need to have a proof that I think this student will uh, give me a low star rating. But yeah, I was deceived by this student. So from now on, I will record every class um, just uh, to have a backup, just to be sure that um, when I need a proof to dispute uh, something to the admin, I can have my evidence. Okay, so you can also do that. Yeah, and maybe I can, we can try to um, ask the admin if they can consider removing that rating. Um, I hope they will be considerate enough. Okay, especially if like you you are consistently getting five stars, but then all of a sudden you get you you got three, two, or one star. Um, isn't that very unreasonable somehow so yeah you can also do that so that's what i'm planning to do from now on i am going to record every class as in every class using ocam all right so again if you also received um a low rating assess yourself um assess your performance during that class and uh improve yourself and conduct more lessons, okay? That's the most important thing. Conduct more lessons, teach more, okay? It's okay to feel stressed. It's okay to feel demotivated. Um, cry if you must. I actually almost cried a while ago, but um, I kept myself from crying because I had my 
uh, book class. And yeah, get mad if you want. And but don't make that don't make it that long, okay? So cry for a while, be stressed for a while, be demotivated for a while, but Again, still look at the br brighter side of it and um, use it as an opportunity to be braver, bolder, <laughs> fiercer, and wiser, okay? And uh, yeah, teach more and still earn more. Uh, still be grateful that you have a job and um, yeah, you can just, uh, you can just teach and earn more five stars because again there are uh, more students who are very generous to give five stars and i'm sure you your low rating as of now will still increase okay and um if you still feel or if you can't get the motivation to um teach more because you're scared of maybe uh getting low stars again just imagine me singing you are not alone i am here with you though you're far away i am here to stay okay so that's it for now mga kananay again still um although your rating is low cheer up and still happy teaching okay bye bye